In this video, we are going to understand about the problems relating to relating to ratios and percentages. So we are given a problem. Gokul Dham Society is planning for going to a zoo in Mumbai. The females are 55% of the total people in the society and are 44. They spent rupees 3000 at the Vada Pao stall in which the driver and the conductor also had their lunch and had incurred rupees 8000 towards payment to bus owner. Find out the ratio of men in society to women. Now, there are two ways in which you can find out the ratios of men to women. Now, you know that the females are 55%. Now, the number of females Okay, so the females plus males is equal to 100%, right? We know the females are 55% plus the males is equal to 100 or the males are equal to 100 minus, you transpose this to the other side of the equality is equal to 45%. Okay. So the males are 45%. Now you can also find out so 55% upon 45% is equal to this is what the number of females. So this should be equal to 44, which is the number of females. Divide by x. Let's say x is the total number of males who are there. Okay. If you solve this equation, you get x. So basically, I move x to this side. So I do a cross multiplication. So 55 into x is equal to 44 into 45. Okay or x is equal to 44 into 45 divided by 55. So 11 times 4, 44. 11 times 5, 55. 5 goes into 45 9 times. 9 into 4 gives us 36. So the number of males is equal to number of males. So if you have to find out the ratio, is equal to 44 upon 36 is equal to 11 upon 9. You can never do this division by 4. So 11, 9. 11 upon 9. One of the other simpler way of calculating the ratio could be that you know the percentage of females is 55 and the males is 45. So the ratio could also be written as, the ratio can also be written as 55% upon 45%. So now you do by 11. Sorry, do by 5. So 11 here and 9 here. So 11 divided by 9. Or 11 is to 9. And the total people in the society are males plus female is equal to 80. Right? Okay, so the first question on the ratio of men in society to women is done. Second question, how much would Leela pay for herself, her husband and kid out of total expenditure on visit? Now first I need to know what is the total expenditure. So Leela is one of the person in the society and she wants to know how much payment do I make in all out of this? So what's the total payment like? Total payment is what you paid at the Vada Pao stall. That's the only information we have. And for the bus. 
so 3000 plus 8000 so the total expenditure on the trip is 11000 and the number of people in the society are 80 now leela her husband and her kid makes 3 out of 80 people so if you want to solve it by unitary method that also you can do so 80 people incur a cost of 11000 one will incur a cost of 11000 divided by 80 or if you have 3 so 11080 divided into 3 this goes here by 4 2 again by 4 you have to divide this that should give you how much 2 30, 7, 25. So 275 into 3 divided by 2. Or 412 rupees 50 pesos. So Leela, Leela pays how much? 412 rupees and 50 pesos. What is the percentage of distance left once they halted for lunch? Now unfortunately, we don't have any data regarding to this question. So we will have to kind of skip this question. The third part of it. There is no data, so we write no data. 